Man! <laughs> Aggie physics professor Tatiana Yorohimova is a force of nature. What's happening? What's happening? Kids are thrilled whether she's demonstrating liquid nitrogen or vacuum pumps on marshmallows. I'm pumping out air. No pressure from outside, same pressure from inside. She averages 50 shows a year on okay. campus. So I need a volunteer from each row. Undergraduate students build the models and assist, all to share their love of science. An average person can go out and do this cool physics experiment, understand it, and be able to replicate it and explain it to others. They use everyday items from balloon animals to toilet paper, all hoping to inspire the next generation of physicists. One of you has to find the material that behaves as a superconductor at room temperature. Nobel Prize is guaranteed. Don't forget to send me email when you get it. She's been doing this since 2007, and it's helped recruit new Aggies. Some students who were here in middle school, I see them in my class. They tell me, do you remember me? Not really, but yes. <laughs> Energy, joy, and knowledge are infectious. We have 1.93 million subscribers on the Texas A&M Physics channel. Yeah, isn't it crazy that physics has more subscribers than Texas A&M Athletics? <laughs> it's hard not to be excited once you see all these super cool experiments. Look, no strings, ma. <laughs> and it hasn't just generated all that social media excitement, but dollars and cents as well. Distinguished professor of physics Ed Fry began the shows at a hugely popular annual physics festival. Both have helped with endowments and gifts. I think about 65 million or something like that. As for the kids, what are they talking about? Something that um, that's a superconductor at room temperature. I love physics. It just turned into my new favorite subject. Liquid nitrogen goes in! Because basic science can be explosive. <laughs> and rain down all kinds of new ideas. <laughs>